As many of you know, yesterday we began to monitor in a tropical storm. Uh, it is now reaching uh, what uh, is very close to hurricane uh, force winds, a category one. Uh, we expect uh, some landfall somewhere uh, around 8 p.m. this evening. Uh, that is different from the earlier reports we had had somewhere between 10 and midnight. That is actually a good sign. The storm is moving. What we do not want it to do is loiter out in uh, on the warm water uh, to be able to pick up more moisture and then uh, and then strike our Gulf Coast. Uh, obviously, you can stay home during this one, but prepare for it. Shutter your windows. Make sure you understand there's going to be somewhere between 60 and 80 mile an hour wind, uh, gust to 80 miles an hour wind, so that could do a great deal of damage. Uh, we could have anywhere between five and eight uh, inches of rain in a, in a hurry. There will probably be a, a surge uh, of uh, waves uh, that will come in around 8 o'clock and thereafter. So you're going to have a lot of water uh, in this area in a hurry. Uh, we want everyone to take precaution. Uh, one of the things that I asked the National Guard to do uh, later on in the evening was drive a high water vehicle down Highway 90 because we wanted people to see that this was a serious situation. And when you see a National Guard vehicle uh, with soldiers in it, you realize you've got a storm. And so we want people to take this uh, very seriously. It's not time to be playing in the surf. It's not time to be windboarding. It is time to take this as a serious uh, storm uh, and be prepared uh, to react to it. <laughs>